Choose where the fast lane is to be placed in the pool. The water depth must be 35 inches. There must be a minimum of 24 inches between the fast lane and any adjacent wall or pool obstruction. Position the hose cover tray onto the pool deck so that the vertical lip of the tray is seated firmly against the coping. The tray will be centered to the fast lane. If the pool has bullnose coping, it is acceptable for the hose cover tray to be slightly out of level. Use the provided 5 32nd inch drill bit to drill a hole into the deck approximately 2 inches deep through the two holes in the rear of the tray. While these two screws are enough to secure the fast lane to the pool wall, extra anchor screws have been provided for additional anchor points if desired. Align the hose cover tray with the pre-drilled holes. Use the provided anchor screws to secure the hose cover tray to the deck. Loosely secure the hanger bracket to the hose cover tray with one of the provided half-inch stainless steel screws. Measure down from the top of the hanger bracket to the water line. This measurement is called freeboard. Once the measurement has been taken, remove the hanger bracket from the tray. Carefully lay the assembled fast lane down on its front face. There are six pre-drilled holes in the center of the top housing between the protective hat channels. Align the top set of holes in the rear of the housing with the appropriate number hole in the hanger bracket. If the freeboard is 6 inches, then align the number 6 holes with the top holes in the housing. When the hanger bracket is positioned on the housing, use the provided 3 quarter inch screws to attach. Place the fast lane lid onto the top of the fast lane and use the six three quarter inch stainless steel screws that were provided. There should be three on each side. This next step is best done with two people. Carefully lower the fast lane into the pool. Align the holes in the bracket with the holes in the hose cover tray. Use the provided half inch screws to attach the top screws first and then the vertical screws next. There should be a total of 8 screws. Secure the stainless steel bond wire that exits the top of the fast lane to the bond lug attached to the hose cover tray. Attach a number 8 bare copper wire to the bonding lug attached to the hose cover tray and then incorporate that wire into the pool's bonding grid. Run the hydraulic hoses up and out of the pool and into the hose cover tray. Place the hoses under the hose clip that was previously secured to the tray. Once the hoses are in the hose clip, tighten the hose clip screw. Place the hose cover onto the hose tray and use the provided half inch stainless steel screws to attach the cover to the tray. If the distance between the fast lane and the power unit is 25 feet or less, then the hoses attached to the fast lane will connect directly to the power unit. If the distance between the fast lane and the power unit is greater than 25 feet, then additional run hoses will be required. Use the adapters provided with the hydraulic run hose to connect the hoses attached to the fast lane and the additional run hose.